When Federal Reserve Chairman Ben Bernanke speaks, Wall Street listens. Investors today anxious to hear what the Fed chief has to say about inflation and interest rates. He's going to be speaking to economists in Massachusetts at 1 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Investors also anxious to see if the Dow can make history today. And yesterday's trading, it closed at 13,649. That's just about 26 points off an all-time high. The Nasdaq closing 26,70, its fifth gain in a row. Investors today will have their first chance to react to second quarter earnings reports. Aluminum giant Alcoa kicked off the season last night with numbers that met expectations. Shares of Boeing will also get some attention today. That stock flirting with all-time highs yesterday in response to the company's new 787 Dreamliner aircraft. Have you ever tried to use your credit card at a store and been told that you can't on purchases under $20, $10, or even $5? The Wall Street Journal says the next time that happens, ask to talk to the manager. That store is in violation of rules from both Visa and MasterCard that oblige them to accept cards regardless of the size of purchases. And it'll say merchants try to sidestep these rules to avoid fees. So you might want to remind them they are in violation. For more business news, click on cbsnews.com. I'm Stacy Tisdale in New York.